Chloe the Dancing Cow Written and illustrated by Matt Ballard For my wonderful Chloe Doodle, the best niece and uncle could ever ask for, always remember you can be anything you want to be. Love always, Uncle Matt. All her life, Chloe had wanted to be a dancer. She loved dancing so much, it was all she thought about. She watched dancing on TV while chewing her grass. She went to the theater to watch the ballet. She practiced dancing on her tippy toes in the field behind the barn. More than anything, Chloe wanted to be a dancer. Then one day, she got a flyer in the mail advertising a new dancing school that was opening in town. Chloe could hardly believe her eyes. A dancing school? She just had to go and see. The next morning, Chloe tucked the flyer in her purse and set off to town. She was very excited. In town, it wasn't hard to find the new dancing school. There was a great big pink tutu on the top of the building, and below it were big pink letters that read, Dancing School. Chloe peeked in the window. She could see lots of dancers in their dancing outfits doing lots of fancy dancing. Nervously, Chloe opened the door and went inside. A very nice lady in a pink tutu came over. Would you like to dance with the other dancers, she asked. Oh, yes, said Chloe. Could I? Of course, the nice lady said, and handed Chloe a pink tutu to change into. Chloe quickly changed into the pink tutu in the change room and hurried out to join the dancing. She felt magnificent in the pink tutu as she stepped and turned and spun and dipped with the other dancers. She danced another dance, and another, and another, until finally the dancing was done and the class was over. As Chloe changed out of her pink tutu, she already couldn't wait to come back again for another class. Her dream was coming true. She was going to be a dancer. She would be Chloe the Dancing Cow.